San Diego State football has been a part of our family since we graduated from college. So many things in my life have happened because of what started here. First of all, meeting my wife. So we met at San Diego State University in 1980, and she caught my attention right away. That smile, right? That smile is uh, pretty much what, what gravitated me. I think as we have grown together and really are feel very blessed to have the life that we do. We have a daughter, Katie, who's 26, and a son, Brandon, who's 29, and they both live in Austin, Texas right now. I'm very thankful for Mike for all of his support in my endeavors, and it's a great team that we have together. So the Real Estate Center at San Diego State is named after a, a Hall of Fame honoree, Corky McMillan. His son Mark and I were on the board together. It's fun to connect to the students and give something back. That's a real world industry experience. We're here in the engineering and interdisciplinary building where entrepreneurialism is the centerpiece of what San Diego State's doing. And if you think about our business in real estate or any other business, it starts with that individual idea of how to build a company and build a product. We're at the HG Fenton Idea Lab. Here, students who prototype an idea to try to start a company can come over here and make it. Passing it along is how that future is created, and so I think it's super important to get back. So the HG Fenton Company owns and manages apartment buildings and industrial buildings throughout the county. Some of them we built, some of them we bought. For the ones we build, each individual project is its own experience. We envision what the customer will experience. Today, you're standing on the rooftop of Amo which is a 28 unit apartment building with two retail spaces. And on the north side is a 97 unit apartment building with three restaurant spaces. And when we bought it, the Little Italy community came to us and said, would you build a European style public piazza for us? And we thought, what a unique opportunity. The first of its kind in downtown San Diego, truly a wonderful public place. To put this project together, of course, takes a big team. But I'm an Irishman, right? Michael Patrick Neal, and this is an Italian community. So we hired a gentleman by the name of John Larea, good Italian man, and John actually worked hand in hand with the community to bring the piazza piece to life in all the planning and working with the community. Carol Whaler, who runs our residential division, had a hand in all of the interior design and layout of the units. It's really a fantastic team of people that bring something like this to life. I met Mike Neal about 19 years ago. H.G. Fenton was performing a due diligence on a property in Carlsbad called Seagate, and I tagged along as part of the uh, due diligence team and was able to meet him there. Well, to be very candid, I begged Mike to hire me. Um, so impressed with his integrity and how much he knew, I thought I had an opportunity to go to the next level in my career and really learn a lot from him. Mike doesn't hold any cards or information or wisdom. He just dispenses it all. And with that, it's up to us, you know, the next leaders, um, to learn from him, soak it up, and then put our own spin on it to propel H.G. Fenton forward. So when I started at the H.G. Fenton Company, I had come from a contracting company. My family, all in the contracting business. I ended up here at the H.G. Fenton Company. My wife at the time was eight months pregnant. My first day, we, I went down to the Otai River Valley where we were kicking people out who were melting batteries to get the lead out. And I went home to my wife and said, I think I made a huge mistake. <laughs> this isn't what I wanted to do. And she said, well, I'm very pregnant. You figure it out. Um, but it got better after that. And when I showed up here, even though we were in the construction materials business, that vocabulary was a little foreign. And it was like, whoa. And so we started doing 360 degree evaluations where you know the people that work under you evaluate you over you and support you. And my first 360, let's just say it was very different than my view of myself. And I share with everybody here that uh, it was one of the greatest growth experiences that I had. This, I had to grow from there to be the person I thought I was being from an impact perspective. What I discovered along the way is helping people build their careers was something that I got great, great satisfaction out of. I show up here today because we get to build people's careers, they get to flourish, um, and we've created something very unique. And I wanna ensure that I'm a part of that continuing. It has been really rewarding to watch him um, to get to where he's at today. And it's no accident because he's worked really hard to do so. We create lifestyles where we, the employees, flourish, our residents live well, and businesses succeed. And we live that every day through our values and how we interact and do everything we do. And it's easy to say that as the CEO of the company. What's really powerful is when our customers tell us those words, when our employees share that that's their experience with us, and when our residents share that it's very different living with us, and they get to feel like they get 
to live well. It's, that's when it really matters.